Hello everyone, welcome back to the Crossword. Friday, May 14th, so we're going to do the May 14th Friday Crossword. Shocking, I know. Alright, let's get started. No further faffing about. Gold Coast Port. I mean, that's in Australia. What are some Australian cities? Um, Adelaide. Uh... What the hell is the capital? Why can't I think of the capital? Oh, it's Sydney. Sydney's one. I don't know. You can bank on them. ATMs? Blank Camp. 2020 Oscar nominated documentary. I don't know. Women's rights pioneer Elizabeth Blank Stanton. Don't know. Clear. Hmm, not sure. Words from Mission Control. I don't know. We'll get more process for that eventually. Uh, to grade a paper is to mark it in some dialects. Um, a grade is an incline. It's a rating for, like, um, steak, beef, I don't know, meat in general. Certain hieroglyphs, I don't know, suns, cats, probably an S anyway. Bygone potentate, ooh, potentate is like a, a, a country or something, right? A nation, a nation-like power? I don't know. Ooh, snacks known as student fodder and scroggen in Germany and New Zealand, respectively. Student fodder. Snacks. There's numerous things that could qualify, but... Did I say Scoggin? It's Scroggin. Anyway. Home of the Stars. One of the original eight WNBA teams. Four letters? It could be Utah. Give me an H here. I don't know. What few flyers desire? Middle seat. Nobody wants the middle seat. I think more leg room, which obviously is a the thing they do desire, but also it doesn't fit. Clear. Mud. Clear as mud. Hmm. Yeah, but how about a real answer? Clear. Michael is Sp Scott Pilgrim versus the world. That's Michael Tsara. Bug expert? Well, that's like... Um, a spy, yes. They're experts in planting bugs. Blank camp. Ship camp. Clip camp. I don't know. Stops lying. You rise if you are no longer lying down, I think. Cut. I'm not sure. Things that would pique your interest on TV. A cliffhanger? Maybe an ad, but not usually. Probably ends with an S anyway, and so does this, so... Leftovers from a donut hole. A donut, say. Well, there's, like, donut holes. Oh, what do they call those on the East Coast? This is a New York thing. There's a special name for a donut hole that Dunkin' Donuts uses that's popular on the East Coast. Also, they're not called Dunkin' Donuts anymore. They're called Dunkin'. Shows what an old stick in the mud I am. I can't remember. 14 million years for the age of the universe. That's an estimate. Grade rate, okay. Cut. 
Ah, someone who was cut from a play or a or a company was axed. I X, huh? You thought wrong. Yeah, okay, judge unfairly. These are pretty long to figure out. Person in the contract though is a party. A bygone potentate would be a shah, not a country, but a ruler of a country. I was confused. Okay. Home of the stars. Okay, it's Utah. Good for me. I wonder if they like use the double Z's to call back to the jazz on purpose. I assume so. Certain hieroglyphs. Cups? Probably. Those were hieroglyphs, but maybe something else. C U C is just not a common way to start something, right? Hmm. Winter Olympics equipment sleds. They use sleds for bobsledding. A little bit worrying that it's not pluralized in the clue, but equipment is vague enough it could be plural, I think. C44 down, straight up. Well, so this is the second word of a two-word phrase meaning straight up. I'm not sure. Old Forester and Old Overholt offerings? No idea. Ethereum or Bitcoin? Ugh, e-money. Get out of here, New York Times. No one would say that. Shame? Dunno. And a berry is a sigh, though. Shame. Need more crosses? Site of an underground pool, maybe. There might be one in a cavern, but... A zinger? Are we looking for a mot, really? I'll have to learn more about what that word really means. I only ever see it with bon in front of it. Recently I've gotten this as a crossword by itself a couple times. Teaser ads. Might pique your interest on TV. A grotto might have an underground pool, I guess. Well, it's unsatisfactory is not up to snuff. I think. Straight up. Oh, due north kind of thing, maybe? True north? I think it's straight up, like, meaning truthful, but... Straight up. Yeah, it could be true north. <sighs> this is so weird. Judge unfairly say. This looks like stereo, doesn't it? Oh, an ass? Stereotype is to judge someone unfairly in a way. Au contraire. I was like, A-U-C makes no sense. But yes, two different... Two, there's a letter break there in a way that's not common in English. Or a word break, I should say. I don't know if this is Twix's, by the way. I don't know. Got an eight? Get an 800 on a GMAT. I guess is ace it? Animal that comes to short to lay eggs is a sea turtle. Bell blank Italian cheese. Uh, not sure. Inclined? If you're inclined to do something, you're apt to do it. El Pa, I don't know. One of the candidates is Ted. Single payer. Leftovers from a donut. There, there's, there's also like Tim something. The Tim Hortons has a special name for theirs as well, but I don't know what they're called. Easy two pointer should be a tip in, I think. Yes, the, you could end west with urn to get western. Gifts that are usually scented, a lay. 
That sort of be stuck talking to the gathering in boars. Deep cuts gouges? Could be. Doesn't have to be. Does a deep dive on top of the geeks out? Yes. They can cause anxiety. Mm, not sure. Savory Scottish delicacy. Is that haggis? Bygone tuna. Oh, it's not gouges. Oh, wait. Ahi isn't. Oh, I'm sorry. Big eye. That is a bygone. Ahi is sure. That's a tuna. Tim Blanks. Gashes. Go down. You go down if you lose. But it could be other things, I think. U.S. city, the home to the largest Basque population outside Spain? This could be Boise. And then we could have lose here. And a tall order would be a latte. Easy. One of eight in the 12 days of Christmas. Oh my god. Five golden rings. Six. I don't know. I can't... Uh... Could be Lords of Leaping. Hey, Lords of Leaping. Maybe. Oh, I, I haven't even watched a whole episode of The Wire. I, I When I was doing like a trial of HBO Max or whatever, um, I was like, everyone says The Wire is so good, I should watch it. And I just like, I could not get through an episode. It probably would have picked up at some point, but it was just not for me. A coffee spot is a stain? I shouldn't even admit this on the internet. Who knows? Uh, stress something? Stressors can cause anxiety. It should be an O, not an E, right? Fort Sutter, probably, is in Charleston. I'm not sure, but... Comedian Margaret Cho? Actor who played Senator Vinnick on The West Wing. Who the hell is... I watched a lot of The West Wing as a kid, and then I even watched, like, season one of it on Netflix a while ago. Or... Is it on Netflix? I think it is. But who the hell is Senator Vinnick? I don't remember him. He's not a main character at all that I can recall. Ducks. Maybe it's not Joe. Or maybe it's not Fort Sutter. I mean, it's maybe more likely. I'm pretty sure it's Margaret Cho, though. Raw materials are ores. Okay. Okay, so I, I wondered if Sumter might... Well, but... That also has a CT problem. I mean, there could be an album named CT something, but... Oh, this must be Brute Force down here? Yeah. Okay. St. Blank, locale in an English nursery rhyme. St. Ives. Studies. Uh, your den is your study. This must be FBI? Yes. I see. People are folks? Shucks could be heck? Could this be... Oh, it could be CTRL. Control. Yeah, okay. How now to a cow? I guess that could be so... I don't know. Moo? Two? I actually don't know, because I'm pretty sure Fort Sumter is a place. And I'm pretty... Fort Sutter sounds plausible, too. How now to a cow? Yeah, okay. I guess if a cow wanted to say how now, what it would say instead would be moo. I'll pencil this in, but I think it's right. SG blank? That's a little spooky. Oh, no, it's not. All systems go. There you go. Hockey game highlight for some. A melee. You must be offering ride whiskeys. Begin the toasting process. Raise a glass. To shame someone who's to something is a base it. L Probably an I, right? That sounds Italian. Oh, no, nope, because October Festival Cal is a beer garden. We have tire marks. Oh, a different kind of donut completely, not Tim. Okay. 
Oh, trail mixes. Okay. Drug Kingpin, uh, I still don't know, but we're doing the down. Split in a way you have something. Must be Marlo or Carlo or something. Maids, Maids of Milking. Ac Alan Alda, okay. I can see why even if he wasn't a, you know, mainstay character, he might have been on a couple times. Grip Camp? Grip Camp? I don't know. I mean, this could be rid. Like, if you're rid of something, you're clear of it. Could it be anything else? Hid? Not really. Did? No. Aid? I don't think so. Aid? No. Bid? No. I think it has to be rid. I'll pencil it, though. I don't like it. <sighs> okay, and how about this camp? Trip camp. That Yeah, that's possible. Trip camp. Grip camp, yeah. So far we have, what, T and G? A rip camp? Like an A is possible here, but it doesn't make much sense. There's C, I guess. Crip camp? Hmm, those are the only letters that I think make any sense. Is Agora a place? Now, but then we have Oadi, which is possible. I mean, names have all kinds of weird sounds in them. Odi. <sighs> Grip Camp. What would that documentary be about? Gymnastics? Skateboarding? Something like that? Hmm. Rock climbing. Okay, how about this down? There's so many things that work here when it's a name and there's an A coming. Like, just about any consonant and most of the vowels are possible. But, to fit into the across, I think it has to be a, a vowel, doesn't it? Unless, like, Athra were a place. Or, like, Atkra. What about a K? Or a C? Those, like, those look like actually plausible name parts, right? And they could fit with a C here. So what if I put it the C here? I try a C. First try, no problem. Easy. Acra, huh? And Crip Camp. I guess something about how uh gang induction happens, maybe? Crip Camp. Nope. Oh, Crip is in Cripple, a disability revolution. Huh. Okay. 
And where, what does Accra, I mean, like, obviously it's, it's a city on the Gold Coast, but like, I don't know, why don't I know anything about it? Do they have anything there? Wait, is the Gold Coast not in Australia? It's in, this place is in Ghana. Where is that? Oh, the Gold, Gold Coast is a city in Australia, not a region. And it's a region in Ghana, I guess. Huh. Interesting. There's a lot of places called Gold Coast, apparently. There's someone, there's some in California. Okay, well, this explains why I was so confused. I knew Gold Coast was in Australia, but I thought it was a region, not a city. So I was trying to find a city in that region. Hmm. Uh... Marlow, okay. The rest of this looks pretty okay. Nothing that really needed like me to learn something new. I think Shaw. I did remember. Sh I, I I did have Shaw wrong. Um, or I I had the idea of a potentate wrong. I forgot what it was. Not up to snuff. Glad to pick that one up with so few crosses. Raise a glass, beer garden. There doesn't seem to be anything tying the, the, the big clues together. No particular theme that I can tell. Fort Sumter I did have to, like, sort of know. All right. Um. Oh, wait, didn't I... Didn't I learn something to do with... I mean, I don't know. I guess this isn't really something about Utah that I learned. Okay. Let's move on to the mini. Let's get started. Cause of a jolt while driving? Don't know. Same. Me too. Plan demoted to dwarf. That's Pluto. It means the world to me. Don't know. Reproductive health specialist, formally. Informally, I mean. Uh, I'm not sure. It doesn't seem like an OBGYN. Secure with rope as a rock climber. Delay. Complete reversal is a U turn. Words to live by are a motto. Bump. Ooh. Earth. Okay, guy know. Okay. Yeah, fair enough. I had the wrong abbreviation in OBGYN. I don't know, are you supposed to say those as letters or like pronounce them obgin or something? Obgyn? I don't know. Um, where were we? Spelling bee time. Pretty bad time on the mini, right? I didn't actually look that closely. I guess it was less than a minute, probably? Yeah, 40 seconds. Still pretty bad for me. Here we go. Alchemy. Okay, that's all for today. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.